Right, okay, I just got this one. Uh, it's like a buckle, there's a lot of iron in there. And it's sort of spread out, the rust has. So I'll have to clean that one up and then see what it looks like. Right, let's get on to the next. Right, just got that one. It's a farthing, uh, Victorian, I think. Yeah. The trouble is, it's all crumbled on the edge. I don't know the date, it's a bit rubbishy that side, but uh, yeah. Right, on to the next. Right, just got a nice bit of silver. That. Yeah. Looks uh, fairly old, it's got a little rib along there to strengthen it. It's very thin, it's been battered, but it does look quite old. So it's got some marking on there. I think further down it's got something down there. Uh, looks like M star and it looks like a C with a line across going downwards vertically down into the sea. I'll just try and get a bit better macro. Uh, right. You can see it there. Is that I think that might be a bit better. Yeah. Weird. But nice, nice bit of silver. Right, on to the next. Right, got called off by rain yesterday. Just too much. What well, I've done. Uh, that bit uh, up into where I've got the lines out here. Well, I say the lines, the line. Just going to use one line and just keep moving it up so many paces out. And now uh, we've got the rest to do. Found the uh, silver spoon yesterday, it's quite nice. And the buckle, hopefully, there'll be a few more in there. Maybe some silver. Alright, we'll get on with it and see what happens. Catch you when I find some. Right, just got this one. Uh, the first find, just done a couple of runs up with the line and uh, looks like, um, I've had a look at it, looks like a George four. You can just see his head on there, I can see the four ones at the side, on the left hand side. Yeah, it's alright, it's quite thick, it's a farthing. Uh, it's crumbling a bit, but we'll see what comes out, can't get a date. But uh, yeah, first one. Let's see what else we can get. Right, I've just got two signals from the old detector. I've just done a few more passes and didn't get any more signals. And uh, I've just got this one. And just there, I've got a piece of iron. And it picked that up. And it also picked another signal up, which is really not far away, which is pretty good for this machine. And it's a Georgian halfpenny. Well, I think it is. And we'll clean it up and uh, see what it is. Right, very good. On to the next. Well, I just took a plug and uh, give a good signal. And I just spotted it there. It does look like lead, but it does look like a spindle wire. Quite a nice one as well. I haven't got one like this, it's actually got patterns on it. Nice one. Clean that up, it's got little dots on it. Raised dots. Same that side. I'd say that was pretty old. All in the middle, somewhere. Need to clean it out. It's got a stone in it, I think. Yeah. Nice one, nice big one. Oh, that's made my day. Cool. Alright, on to the next day for that. Alright, back out again. Uh, it's quite nice today, it's a bit fresh, but it's okay. It should be a sunny day, hopefully. 
Uh, last week, you can see I've got a line out here. I'm just using one line. Wait, you can see it. There it is. <laughs> uh, I did half, well, at least half of this bit up to that edge from this line. And uh, I was getting loads of false signals. Now, I had the other metal detector. It just like wasn't picking anything up. It was really weird. I don't know if because the ground was wet. Um, I don't know, but uh, I'm having to go back over it. And I have already found two things, one of them being this large pattern button. Let's get a macro and I'll show you the other thing. That's quite nice. And um got that in my pocket. A George the second half penny, which is in reasonable condition, considering. Well you can read it. Bit of a white that George is on, then you can see the two ones at the top just there. Yeah, okay, we'll carry on, see what we can get. Right, back with another find. I'm glad I'm redoing this because it's still it's in the old, and you can see there it is. Looks like another thruppence, silver thruppence. Let's see. Let's get out. Well, looks like uh, Victoria, young one. It's a good one, that side. Let's see what we've got this side. Oh, yes, yes, yes. That's nice. All the ones I usually find are all smooth. I suppose because they're in circulation for so long. You can see that 18 is it? I don't know. I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to get my glasses on to have a look at that. But you can probably see that. Let's see what, well, let's get a macro. It's about there. Eighteen eighty one or eighteen sixty one. Nice though. That'll do me. A few more of them. That would be not nice. Oh, there's the next two. Right, just got that one. I don't know what it is. Some kind of copper or something. I don't know whether it's a tag or whether it's. Something on it and there's a hole in it. I don't know, weird. Needs a bit more investigation. There's certainly something on it. Some writing. Right, let's see if we can find out else. 